What's up everybody, this is Astro Orange here, back with another video. Finally, today we are on Project Equivalence Episode 3, and boy, has it been a while. So, <laughs> sorry guys, I've been a bit busy for the last, I think it's been a few months now, um, but hopefully I can start uploading again regularly. So we're back on our world just as we left it. I may have done one or two things. Um, I did farm up some EFC off camera. Right now I'm cooking up some stone and you'll see why. That's a little hint there. And I guess the mob farm that we started is a major giveaway from last episode. Um, someone in the comments posted a comment saying um, to farm cocoa beans for EMC. And yeah, it actually really was pretty efficient. So the comment should be displayed right now. So huge thanks to that person. And... Uh, yeah, I did that a long time ago now, and I haven't been on this world in a bit. So right now we're just smelting up this stone, and I'm actually going to be finishing the mob farm today, hopefully. We're probably going to do the sorting system next episode, but uh, I want to get the farm kind of functioning today. So how we're going to do it is use these vector plates, I guess. So obviously the wall will be here. Um, so I guess the way it would work is the mobs will fall in like this here I, I have a very uh, weird time working with these okay so they point like this I'm pretty sure and then I think when you walk on them yeah yeah they push you forward so we're just gonna be using the basic ones uh, I haven't tried out the other ones but well maybe, maybe we'll upgrade to them later but right now these are fine I've used these before on other mod packs um, and yeah, well, we'll just be using these. That way we can have like a pretty basic mob farm. We don't need to kill them with fall damage because of the spikes down there. Uh, and I'm starting to realize we're going to need a very large amount of these vector plates, which is okay. That's why we have all the stone smelting. And we pretty much got everything else other than the stone. Um, and yeah, so I'll get back to you guys when that's done. So as I'm building this, I'm starting to realize I think I may have counted wrong, and I think that this is not an even number platform, but I think it's, it'll be okay, I think. Um, and I'm also realizing that it's really hard to build with these. Ah, there we go. And also, elephant in the room. Shaders! Yeah, so we'll be trying them out. Um, we'll see how they work. If uh, they take a, too big of a hit on performance, then we'll have to get rid of them. But as of now... I can handle them on this pack, so we'll play around with them while we can at least, so yeah. So big tip with these, don't jump on them. They, uh, it'll help, like if you're trying to walk this way, it'll kind of just push you more. Just slowly walk, it'll be hard to push against, but you will eventually do it, so yeah. Okay, last three, there we go. Uh, now just the wall, I think. Yeah. Um, also, for this like new stacks mod that I've been playing around with, um, is there a way to somehow like take out a certain number? Like for example, I used to be able to like shift click on something and only get like a stack, but now it pulls out. That's a bad example because emeralds are expensive. Now it pulls out like everything it can. Like it totally drains my EMC, right? So I don't know. Is am I dumb? Like, is there something that I can be doing instead? I don't know. Like some hotkey or something. Um, let me know in the comments, guys. But now, I think we're ready to start working on the wood. So, I do want to see something now. You know what we'll probably just do, actually? We'll probably just build it out of cobblestone and maybe we'll replace it later. Oh, boy. 8,000 cobblestone, yes. <laughs> we'll need that much. Although, we probably will need a lot. Not that much, obviously, but... So, we'll probably do it like this. We'll build too high up. Uh, I don't really want Enderman spawns in this, so I'm not going to build it three because I'm worried they'll teleport. I might make it three later on because I think there's a device, I forget what it's called, where you can place it on the bottom and any Enderman within a certain radius uh, can't teleport. And I believe neither can you with the, like Ender Pearls. Um, so that will be good. I think we'll probably want that. Okay, and now we'll just do this and I will probably end up putting slabs on top of this whole thing then because that'll just be the easiest to prevent mob spawns on top i could put torches but i don't want to risk accidentally uh you know messing something up with the farm what am i doing okay 
I don't want to accidentally mess something up with the farm by, I don't know, maybe not missing a spot and then I'll be down there and boom, creeper explosion. And it would suck if it was like, I don't know if charge creepers can spawn naturally on this mod pack. That's not, that is something that I would not be very surprised with if that could be a thing. So. Also, if we have time today, I might want to make, because I noticed we could get cobalt and manilium from, not manilium, manilium is the alloy, cobalt and erudite from the um, transmutation table. So maybe we'll work on making some basic tools today, because this pickaxe kind of sucks, and so does the sword, which I haven't really needed to use it yet, because I'm a chicken and have kept it on rewinded time, so I still haven't seen really night on this uh, world yet. But maybe I'll uh, turn that off so we can see night. I mean, it's got to be at least a little bit of a challenge, right? So, a little uh, Q&A. Have you guys watched any of my other videos um, who are here? Like, have you watched my single player? Did you watch the Consentus SMP while that was running? Um, fortunately, I'm pretty sure that is at least temporarily. Um, dead because of inactivity. Maybe we'll start it up again eventually. I'm still um, in the group technically, I think. But, you know, none of us are really active on the server, I'm pretty sure. So maybe that'll start up again on another season. Maybe we'll do something different. Maybe we'll have more people. But as of now, that's not happening. Um, so, yeah, what do you guys think about my other series, though? Like, the single player. I've been thinking of starting the single player again because like I said I haven't uploaded in a long time and even when I was uploading it has still been a while since my single player um, episodes I've been focusing more on like this and the consensus I'm talking like this has been like around for so long this is only episode three though <laughs> oh I already hear guys okay let's do this quickly I'll change this up for glass later, but just right now, because guys are spawning, I am going to just put cobblestone here. I know, guys, this is an amazing, beautifully designed mob farm, right? It looks amazing. Totally. So, to collect the drops, should I just put vanilla hoppers underneath, or are they, like, crazy expensive in this mod pack? Um... Okay, wooden hopper, what is that? Okay, they're a little expensive. Iron plates, can I make that any other way? I, <laughs> you need an iron plate to make an iron plate cast. That's nice. Glass is not a natural resource, so yeah, it won't be there. So sand, not sammed, sand. One, two, three, four, that should be enough. That should smelt pretty quickly. I mean, I guess guys should be spawning right now, right? Oh, and slabs we need to make. Um, that should be enough, right? I almost shift clicked it and then we would have been in a big problem. Well, I hear creepers already, so I'm more worried about the creepers than anything, honestly. If those guys get out and start exploding, it will be pretty bad. I guess I'll do this and be right back. Okay, I know I keep changing my mind between slabs and um, torches, but I think I, I put slabs along the rim here. I think I'm just going to use torches, though. There's nothing... Not like the light will shine through the block or anything, right? Like, I'm not forgetting some basic Minecraft mechanic that you guys are going to be like, Hey, you idiot. I'm just kidding. <laughs> Um, yeah, I think I can just do this, right? That won't mess anything up. Can I move this, like, one block over? Yeah, I think that should be fine. <clears throat> yeah, and then I'll just put a torch up here. So now, um, if the glass is ready... Yep. I should just be able to do this, right? And die first. We'll switch to suffer more transparent glass, I guess, right? 
Yeah, and I can access the loot bags, and boom, now we should be getting some loot that might be useful as I keep getting... Okay, well, gunpowder, right? I guess these drops, hopefully... I guess the goal is um, to hopefully get, like, good things that are worth a lot of EMC. Like, what are these used for? I have no idea. Um, tinkers. Oh, it's like a tool. Maybe this is a really good material. Or maybe it sucks. I don't know. I've never actually heard of that material. That's weird. Um, seems pretty common, so I'm just going to turn it into EMC then. I guess we can always turn it back, right? So I will do all this. Just clean up my inventory right now. And yeah, I think that is pretty good for today. Um, seems to be working fine. If you guys know of any, like, item collection thing that I can do to make this easier, let me know. Because I can't think of all the item collection methods I use, um, are a bit too advanced for us right now. Uh, so next episode we'll probably make some tools. Let me know your guys' favorite tool combinations, I guess, in the comments. Because I will need to be making, uh, good tools. Uh, tools, mind you, that I will be able to make, so don't tell me to make something out of nether stars i can't do that yet so but anyways i think that's going to be it for today so thanks everyone for watching and i hope you guys enjoyed the video and hopefully we are back to a regular upload schedule so thanks for watching